Welcome to the Commission Report. I'm Gabriella Ferraro for MCTV. Here in the Commission Report, our goal is to keep you up to date on what happened at the most recent meeting of the Martin County Board of County Commissioners. Let's review the meeting that took place on July 12th. After a lengthy public hearing, commissioners approved the rezoning of a parcel west of Palm City from agricultural to planned unit development and accepted a conceptual master plan for a 7.6 acre portion of the 1,700 acre Ag Tech tract. The proposed development is for 32,000 square feet of office space to be located on Martin Highway west of I-95. The site was historically used for citrus production and has been converted to a cattle grazing site. The site will receive public utilities from the City of Port St. Lucie. Once complete, the project is promised to bring jobs to the area and increase the local tax base. Commissioners also approved a master site plan for a residential subdivision of 38 single family homes, two story, zero lot line on 11 and a half acres of vacant land located between Lost River Road and Kantner Drive east of Interstate 95 in Stewart. The development will be called Tidewater Point. Finally, commissioners heard a status update on local water conditions and the toxic algae blooms that have been appearing in our waterways. Staff provided the update showing Lake Okeechobee is at 14.7 feet and that discharges into the St. Lucie River have been reduced. However, algae persists in some areas. Martin County has retained a contractor to test the water and air quality at sites where the algae has accumulated in thick mats. In addition, commissioners learned the Florida Department of Environmental Protection is leading the effort to clean up the waterways where the algae is at its worst. For additional details about an agenda or if you would like to watch a discussion for a specific item, you can go to the county's website, martin.fl.us, and click on MCTV. Well, that's a wrap for the Commission Report. I'm Gabriella Ferraro, and thank you for watching MCTV.